good Monday morning to you all. It is the 24th of August, and today is the feast day of St. Bartholomew. So the Gospel today is from John chapter 1, verses, verses 45 through 51, and it speaks about Nathaniel. Nathaniel and Bartholomew are the same person. And it's the calling of Nathaniel or Bartholomew. And uh, Jesus says, well, well, Philip actually calls Nathaniel and says, hey, come look, check him out. Uh, this guy we've seen and from Nazareth. And Philip makes a kind of a sarcastic comment about him being from Nazareth. But he goes and sees, and Jesus calls him on it. And Philip, or Nathaniel says, yeah, I'm going to follow you. And Jesus says, well, you think you can, you follow me because you, I saw you under a fig tree? Uh, wait till you see. Wait, you know, wait and see. You're going to see greater things than this. And so, well, to be honest, this one's always throwing me because I never could figure out quite what's going on here. Uh, Reddit, nothing's very really stick with me. But what gets me in this one is, it's that question I kind of answered through my homily, is why do we follow Christ? Where, where, how are we called? So Nathaniel responds because uh, Jesus does something a little bit out of the ordinary. And he's attracted to that, but Jesus says, huh, stay a little bit longer and you'll see something even greater. So what's calling me, what's calling you to follow Christ? What's, what's that call coming from? Um, and I think, again, kind of responding back to my homily yesterday, is it has to, we have to own that question. It can't be, well, we go to church, we follow Christ, because that's what my mom and dad want. You know, I'm 50 years old. I think I need to be doing that for my own sake, uh, not because my parents want me to. Uh, so I think we have to ask that question ourselves. Why do we follow Christ? And I think when we begin to concretely answer that, it'll change the way we actually live our faith and experience our faith. Change it for the better, right? So hopefully that makes sense. Enjoy the day and uh, see you back here tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye.